mic testing. Alright, mic sounds good. So, we're gonna be doing the uh, story today. I already did this part. I'm not doing it again. There's no way. Just damn it, dude. I've done like chapter two and all that. No, bro. I was on chapter two. Your son. I... We need you strong. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're going to find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. Careful. He said, Stay close, dude. Stick to the trail. This been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Ah. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. So... Do you think it was a trap in Blackwater? Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Oh. <laughs> you up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Are you in? Hold on, guys. I have to do something really quick. Make it, nor did little. Jenny, that's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is, or was. Yeah. And Mac. Dang, I cannot get mine. You don't know. Monitor, right? Business. Gosh, I really cannot get my monitor in the right spot, dude. It's so annoying. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't 
Salem. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about Crate. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. <laughs> Ain't much, shelter. So, this house, do you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Where did Dutch go? Oh, it's right there. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. Can't think waving. I'm on. Passing you. Okay, go. Get him. Hitch up here. Come on, Arthur. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. Someone's having fun in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Take cover in that shed over there. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Shh. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body food. in the wagon. I hear you. Just keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Over there! More of them! Eat the Dumbasses. Bro is taking a shit. Wait, where, where do I have to go? Oh, I don't gotta run after this guy. Didn't seem to be going too well. A damn Otrisco boy is here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin.
Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Como Driscoll's head. Everybody that's watching, have you guys played Red Dead? On yours. What in Col Dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Place is dry. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Grab anything you it's a party in the USA. Yo, it's a party in the USA. What's up? It's me, MC. We get 20 likes on the stream, I'll sing your song. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. I know there's somebody in here. Play this. Dang, I didn't know he came from the roof. to rob some train gonna blow the tracks with my hands up there playing my song and the butterflies fly away <laughs> well I would say it you better you sing it this, I will if we get 20 that? likes I don't care but bring that horse when you're done Hold up, I do need to edit my video, because right now I think it's just what I'm doing. Whoa. Whoa. 
Good boy. You should stream from another device so you can use OBS. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. I've thought about that, but... I usually just do it for my PlayStation. Get away from me! Michael, what the hell do you think you're doing? Hold still, damn it! Why up the gate? Leave her alone! I wasn't doing yeah. nothing! She's one of them old Driscoll's! No, she ain't, Michael! Look at her! Miss! Miss! Are you... Oh, you fool! Michael! Miss! Now, it is gonna be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss! Miss! Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here, and quick! Come on, now. Oh. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Womp womp. If you have a good enough CPU, you could record the gameplay from the PS5 and stream to YouTube from a PC. I don't have a PC. Mike have found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. We found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently, scouting a train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is, but we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up, give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know... 
the situation were reversed, and he'd look for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. You wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. This bus you. Cross. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. Look out! What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton's. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. The Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> Tracks go left. Down here. Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Tranquilo. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on now. <laughs> hey, look. Over there. You see that? John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. from here I'd grab that shotgun from your horse who knows what's up ahead
but I can't take both. You sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. Will you just put the gun down? Mm. Watch out here. We head that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. Drops down here. Watch yourself. It's slippery, be careful. Watch your head here. Okay, good now. Watch your step, this is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here, come on. Gap here. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John! Damn, it's cold. You wanna move it, Arthur? How you doing? I'm miserable. Then it's a few days. I know. Here, take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Most! John, you there? I'm here. That's John! We're coming! Down here! Over here! All right! Pipe down, Marston! He's down here. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh. I remember this way back when I first started. I've already I've already got to the second chapter, but I remember this and I hated it. Gosh, I hated it. Oh my gosh. Hey. Asshole. Good work, Arthur. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. I think I died the last time that I did that. Come on then. 
Let's get back to the others. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. You know, fella? Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Good rain. Get the hell out of here! Get out! Look out on the right! More coming in on the left! Get out of here! Get out of here! Uh. <laughs> I like this. You see any more out there? No thanks. No. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're going to need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you can do better than that. One thing you ain't short on is fantasy. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. some help we need some help here come on help him down you're alive you're alive come on here we go there we go uh, ah you uh, careful uh, it's his leg oh, come on let's get you warm thank you thank you both this is a new low even by your standards <laughs> thank you i think thank you, you got any other lost maidens need saving <laughs> not today have you and dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong. We get... <clears throat> we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough, I guess. You sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. What do you think, Arthur? <sighs> well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I trust your judgment, Dutch. Always have. Thank you, son. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. Because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. 
apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess... I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Folks been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we What's can't up, fool. C... This is the right call, Arthur. C.E. Gamer. This. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators. Here, Comb always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score they're planning. There. Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. <laughs> what he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Shake oh. yacht. Goddamn ready. ready. Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go.
There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Hi. Hi, Jacob. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Are they leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right, let's go pay our old. I just subscribed. Is this your first time playing? Uh, thank you for subscribing. Um, no, it's not. I've played this before, but somehow it reset me. So that sucks. Yeah, but um, if it if it did, this is not my first time playing. Keep us covered. You got it, Dutch. It reset me. What's wrong with my horse? This one, right? Are you hearing me? You're going to need that right. Good. Come on, let's go. It's easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Have you finished the game? If so, what honor, low or high? I'm not finished the game. I got to chapter two. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of the bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. Well, I believe you can finish it. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. I want to finish it. But thank you. I wish I can give you a spoiler, but I don't think you want one. No, it's okay. I've seen most clips of the game. Oh, watch out. This bit's steep. What console are you playing on? I'm playing on PS5. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Don't forget to like the stream, guys. Stay low. Come on, follow me. How did they not see us? Oh, that's so bad. Get in cover, Arthur. What the hell are you doing? Oh, yo, 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 yo. You know what? I'm not staying back. Yeah, the guys like himself to this guy. We need to Why can't I kill them?
no, 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 no. BTW, try to listen and take a time with missions. Yeah, I thought I could aim at him, but guess not. They'll be important later in the story. Oh, that guy's still alive? Your shooting is better than mine, Lil. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of online. You recognize any of them ducks? Of course not. Tom doesn't give a damn about his men. Oh, hey, all that... Cares about his yeah, guys, like and sub sub to this guy. We need to give him all the support. That was really nice, thank you. I appreciate it. Damn, you just got left a mess. Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the forest! All right. I got smoked. I don't know what happened to my aim there. Maybe it was because my dead eye was low. We don't have time to mess around. Arthur, get over here. So it's not letting me. We're waiting oh. on you, Arthur. I'm here, dude. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go 
search that wagon there. Fuck. Search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Hey. This looks good. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you, boys. All of you. Not a man down. Oh. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Out cause for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Matt, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will. Just like all the rest. But we're done. We're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves. You should play with me online. I'll be your bodyguard. I'm now 691,369. Alright, I'm gonna be probably playing. Hold on, I'm about to hit this guy. Um, I might play online tomorrow. But if I like the story, I might play story too. How long have you been playing, Jacob? Red Dead. Um, yeah, I might play on. I'll probably play online tomorrow. Since 2021. Nice. Leave him to me. Yeah, I'll play online tomorrow. Don't kill him. Yeah. I didn't even mean to kill him, but I guess I just had a lucky shot. That's very important. Yeah. This is uh, very kind of you. Sing California girls. His name is Carrie and Duffy. It's me, we need 16 more likes. I don't know. You don't know your name. It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy, Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't 16 more likes. If it's not updated. For you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. Somebody just on like, so we need 17 more, it's me. Oh, two people just liked. All right, um, fif fifteen more likes, and I'll sing whatever song you want me to. Please, Mister. You're hurting me. You better shut your mouth, you little shitter. I will shut it for you. It's my dream to hear you sing. All right. They don't tell me nothing. I swear. 
text, call some of your friends to go like the stream. That's what I would do. I donated five dollars. Would you restart order progress? Because I will break every um, bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hmm. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Ever since I was two years old. That's two bones right there. I probably would. I would probably restart my progress. But I don't know, maybe. Say less. You don't have to. Don't hurt me, please. Here's five dollars. They're real nice. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up some cap, five dollar bank note. I don't even think <laughs> I don't friend, even think you can donate on my stream for some reason. Shoot fellas. Is need shooting? Save fellas. Done. Is need saving? And feed them. Is need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! If I didn't have my stream open up on my phone, I probably actually would have restarted on my progress. Alright, restart our progress. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Well, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. I just got so important. Driscoll. Oh. They're rivals. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? Ten, twelve people? When I was in the Navy, I, I do not wish to hear about what you got. Do you want a spoiler? Sure. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips... Mike of the trays, so everyone. We'll yeah, I know. We always have. I don't really like Micah. If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look at this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. All right. Let's head out. Yeah. Easy. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Oh, uh, sure. If you can guess what my favorite RDR2 character is, I'll tell everyone it to watch the stream. So, I only know like five. We're gonna find to um, maybe, huh. maybe Dutch? There's meat up here for sure. Pearson or Arthur? Know what he's talking about. Now the weather's I like Dutch. Ahead, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <sighs> Been a while. No two guests left. Right. Right north from Blackwater. Getting stuck in the storm. Give me like a selection of five and I'll have to guess. Because I don't know how many characters. I wish I done it's a girl. 
Oh. Me like that, just um. a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that Is it the one that you save at the very beginning? That, uh, at the house? I don't know what her name is, I forgot. It's the very first mission of the game. Damn it, arrive at Sadie. Oh, yeah, Sadie. Have a little crush on her, lol. See some of the ground uncovered here. Easy. Come on. Mine's country boy Joe. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. Is that even a real character? It's me. I'm guessing it's not. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now, shh. Stay quiet. Cowboy Carl is evil. I see something. Anyway, I wish you the best of luck. I'm in Spain right now. God bless you and have a great rest of your day. Everyone like and sub to this cow. Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the hey, thanks a lot, Jacob. On your horse. A gun will scare everything around. I don't know what time it is in Spain, but um, have a good night or good morning. But yeah, I appreciate appreciate all the support. No problem. Which one's mine? Is it this one? Hope to see you again in the next stream tomorrow. And slowly. I'll play online. Stop running. You're making too much. I hope you reach one million subscribers this year. Uh, Probably not, but me too. Maybe not. Focus. Keep your head down. That'd be awesome. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. It's 4 a.m. here, HBU. 4 a.m.? Dang. It's 10, 10 p.m. for me. Wait, look. There they are. Quick, get that bow out of Nice. See if you can get another one. All right, see, brother, take care. Tomorrow I fly back to Cali. All right, see you. Have fun in Spain. Or if that, if, to, if tonight's your last night, then have a safe flight. Am I supposed to do something with the spear? I don't think so. Ooh, there's two. Whoa, I don't want to use my, my dead eye on the steer. Sure your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one.
I'm out of energy. Tough. Come on then, let's head back. Ha! Whoa. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. <laughs> you notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? If we give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl. She has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang, nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Watch out. Bear up ahead. What are you doing? Shoot! This was a terrible idea. This was a terrible idea. Where did my horse go? How did my horse get scared of a bear that I was shooting at? I obviously had that. Dang, my energy is terrible. Guess not. What are you shooting at? <laughs> we ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? 
now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just know you can run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. time. All right, I'm back. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. For a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Hey? Oh. Jeez, how far is it? Something like that. Since I was a boy. Twenty years? Yeah. You taught me to read. John, too. Tell me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. <laughs> How's that? The horse. He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. 
He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the cow once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. It's next to mine. We don't want him running off. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the boat properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well! <clears throat> Just drop it down in here. <clears throat> What a surprise to find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Ah, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? <coughs> Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skinned that one, did you? Dumped on the floor there. Too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> it's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch. Being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah, and you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur, I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Well, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He see me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. Come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. 
Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. All right! We're moving out! Follow me! Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars to deal with any guards. Arthur and Mike, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on. Let's ride. Feels good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistake. What are you doing? Not again. Hey, what are you doing? So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. Money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. Easy. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Hold. What are you getting off for? Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Easy.
How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I've got it from here. Mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Shit, no! What? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Jump on the train. I remember doing this, bro. It's so badass. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, down here. Pull me up. I got you. Now stop yelling. Help. Yeah, you're okay. Let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? He fell. The others will get him. <laughs> Come on, we need to stop this train. There's another guard up ahead. You want me to take him? Please stop yapping, just help. Oh my gosh, just if this guy doesn't stop yapping, I'm gonna kill him. Look out! Got more 
Tell me that's not hitting! Jeez, that needs a bot. No, he's not. What? What the hell? Lenny, I'm about to. F About to kill Lenny. Shit. More guards coming out of that train car. That better be some money at the end of the day. Time to lock in. All these bastards must be guarding the sub. Still okay? Lenny, do something, shitbag. Jesus. Oh, you're done now. Emma, the tree. Screw this guy. Thanks to Lenny. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now, light the fuse. Here we go. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Search that train. <laughs> 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 
Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see oh, you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay, let's see if we can get this open. When you work for a Come on. No, this looks like some. On. Get in there. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> what did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we could probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. <laughs> Okay, get on the train, quick. No. I mean, these guys have to be somewhat rich, am I right? So I think I think you get low honor if you kill them, but I didn't technically kill them.
Lord's sake. Put that book away and go help. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. Ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yeah. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Stole them clean away from them, it was, every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of Dutch's talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yep. So... What happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. All my life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. 
maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yeah. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay, thank you. the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Sweet home. You weren't wrong, Hosea. This place is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from our dream of virgin land in the west. I know, my brother. But we are Safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer Robin Banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for, for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know 
that things have been tough. But we are safe now. And we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. We have officially made it to chapter two. And six minutes away from hour two. Who was in chat? We got off the mountain, <laughs> rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. We've been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Hi there. Jose. Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm going to read a book. <laughs> And think waving. No problem. I hope you reach 1 million subscribers this year. It's 4 a.m. here, HB. All right, see, brother, take care. Tomorrow I fly back to Kali. Good morning, Art.
Another day. You're Arthur, right? My name ain't no concern of yours. I'm hungry. I don't give a damn. Look, y you seem like a decent feller behind it all. Then you ain't a good judge of character. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll leave it there then. That smells so good. You been on the rum again? Glad to be off that mountain, Mr. Pearson. Yes, indeed. Lots to do now. Yeah, for all of us. Thought you'd be happy to be off that mountain. No, I don't know. You ain't been yourself for a while. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Talk to you later. Arthur, how's the cigar? Not bad. But sometimes I prefer a pipe. I've been meaning to get one for ages. I left the old one in uh, black water. I know. Well, if I find one, you can have it. Hey, you are a gentleman, Mr. Morgan. I raised you well. <laughs> oh, don't take too much pride in your work. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Have a lovely meal. Don't really know what to do. Back to work, boy. Ow! 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 Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Now, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Oh, sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. <sighs> you gonna take the old man into town? You take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take mm -hmm. them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Yeah. A song. You okay? <laughs> I got a girl in a fairy bed. I can't scream because she's too damn ill, so I don't go down. 
Lumbago. It's, it's very serious. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really. You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? <laughs> sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. Is that Riz or is that Riz or W Riz? Come here. <clears throat> Easy. Gentlemen, no, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. Come on, let's go to Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother, there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart, a small one, perhaps hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> <laughs> Um, this looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Do something that old Driscoll stuck. gang from Six Look at all that now. snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the life of her. Decent little town. Other people. Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. See what we got here. 
Go left here, down the main street. Sheriff's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes! We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Just park up down the end there, near the stables. I've seen everything. All right. Here we are, just like I said. The cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at its finest. Uncle. What are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. And I need to get something from the stores. Okay, see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, it... In my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then... Rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Afternoon. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking of that, ain't you? Why don't you pick out a cigar? A cigar always focuses the mind, I find. What do you say? Well, you seem a little scattered, Arthur. Trust old uncle. Full stock list in the catalog here on the counter. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. Here's to your good health, my sir. <laughs> it's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? Seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly? Huh? You can... But damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get your hands off her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey, hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her! I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel.
Can I help you, sir? Try and help people. I, I do all I can manage. Are you doing all you can? Huh? Use your... No trouble now, please. Trying to play him? Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Hopefully, yeah. I kill him. Oh, love Just borrowing it. Hey, stay away from me. Get back here right now. Jeez. Get up. Gosh damn it. Mother. Piece of shit. A horse. So are we ever going to load in? Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. I can't hold on much longer. All right, come on. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. 
Give me Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh. Hmm. He's, he's not. That's very kind of you. Yeah. But I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one sense in this year old mind. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Yep. Back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. Appreciate it. Every man loves their horse. I should not take that away from them. No meal is complete if it don't got me. Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Why well, ain't you just a toughest teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly, yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey! Larry, there he is! Watch where you're going! Take it Are easy. you about to pal? kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our answer! <laughs> Gosh, damn. Shit. Who is waving? Oh, damn. Come on, pretty boy. Pretty boy, you're kidding me. 
Really, boy? I'll crack your damn skull open. Thank you. Stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business <laughs> is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir. But please, I beg you. Oh, what's up, Maskless? I didn't see your comment. Sorry. Look who we found sniffing about. How's your night going? Very same. Well, well. I just beat the shit out of Tommy. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill, looking as well as can be? Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill, come on. Oh, I killed all of these guys. That's crazy. Or they're all dead. Ticket? No, not me. I can have the law here in a trap. Not again.
Not again. there. You know, these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, skilled tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Never do solo. Down a spectrum hey. cloud the sky. To that feller who was hassling you in Valentine. I'll tell you another time, okay? Okay, sure. Months have passed, Moreno. Since last, I held that hand in mine. It fell. Holds be fast, Moreno. So mine. Be fast and far than mine. A hundred months will the flower remain. Went up. That hilly slope we climb. Okay, wow. okay. I'm gonna turn it right up today. Hi, Pearson. Mr. Morgan. How are you? Marvelous. Okay. Hey. Hey there. Hello. Talk to them. You got some speaking to, to do of your own. Not that old gang of yours. I said, I told you, I don't know nothing. That's what I thought. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit! You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, <laughs> who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Uh -huh. Geld him. Oh, yeah! <laughs> What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? A court. There's no way. So, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. 
He's at Six Point Cabin. Oh. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. <laughs> okay, then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Are you sure as shit was? John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cone? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right. I'll leave. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an O'Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked... Give them. And I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time, we want it. Give me something. How about you give it to me? Instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey. Hey. If, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Williamson, Williamson. What, Morgan? Just to say, well, even you can't screw up killing O'Driscoll's. Funny. And I guess you're good here. Unless some soft-handed feller comes along and tells you you've gone too far. What are you talking about? Fighting that big bullock up in Valentine? How wise you think beating a man to death would have been? With all them folks looking on, when we supposed to be laying low. I saw your eyes, Morgan. You didn't go clever, you went soft. Uh, I'll take it. After all, you are an authority on not being clever. The captive gets a little cough in his throat. Looks at you with some big doe eyes. You gonna let Comb go free? I was fighting Comb when you was pretending to fight Indians. Don't call my record into question. It's your abilities that call your record into question, Bill. Now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. Those are the hills. Head for them. Save your horses. We gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... Tell us, then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law, nature. You're out for yourselves. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're 
out to live. Free. Cohn's a sneak thief and a killer. The Dutch is... The Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boss, we're almost on. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. Look out! Someone needs to show you how to ride. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. Settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Come on. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yep. And Colm O'Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell them yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. He's yours, Williamson. Okay. I got him. Don't move. Get close to these two. Make no mistakes here. That's what the knife's for. When we're there, we move at the same time. Come on. Get down this hill or I'll pull you down it. Shit fire! Uh, 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 the camp? I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be.
Take him quiet, Marston. Okay. Get your hands dirty for a change. Jesus. Okay, now what? We're at the perimeter. Time to move on him. You ready? As I'll ever be. Let's go. How you doing, old Driscolls? Glad It's on! We move quick! We move! You are lying, that little toad! Check. You look out here. Hey, he's actually pretty good. He's a good guy. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. You lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. The rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> yeah, right you are.
least you got something tucked away. That's more than I've ever touched on the online game. Jeez, respect. What? What do I do? Idiot. And think waving. I hope you reach 1 million subscribers this year. It's 4 a.m. here, HBU. All right, see, brother, take care. Tomorrow I fly back to Kali. Person Turquoise waving.
Roll out the red carpet. Arthur's back. You're keeping busy? Trying to. Best you stick to the chores. Leave the real work for the rest of us. Your time has passed. Get over it. I'm only joking with you. You're a strange man, Morgan. I apologize in advance for this stew. It needs better meat. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Good morning, Arthur. So you like the new camp, Jack? Sure. It's fine. It'll do us for now. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Uh-huh. How are you? All good there, Pearson? Still need more food, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, you should try your luck again with that bow. I know, I will. So, you and the girls got back all right? Yeah. How'd you get on with that fellow who ran off on you? It's dealt with. All right, well, I should be getting on. All right, then. One of these days, we'll actually get the man to help with the laundry. <laughs> I wouldn't hold your breath. How are you? Okay. Covered from that business in the hotel? Oh, yeah. So we gonna hit that bank I told you about? We'll see. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Okay, then. Hey, Arthur.
How do I save my progress? Or will it just get lost? I'm worried that my stuff is gonna get lost like last time. You're getting nowhere fast, my boy. Hey, Arthur. All right, everybody. Thank you all for watching. We're gonna end it on we're gonna end it on three hours right now, and I appreciate everybody watching. And um, yeah, I'm going to check if this saves, and I'm going to bed. And then tomorrow, I we will do online if Jacob is here. If he's not here, then we'll do story, which I'm I'm liking. You know, it's very very fun, in my opinion. We're going to take a nice photo. Maybe for the next... Um, Hand pink waving. I hope you reach 1 million subscribers this year. It's 4 a.m. here, HBU. All right, see, brother, take care. Tomorrow I fly back to Kali. Person turquoise waving. All right. See you guys again. Thank you for the likes. And the two subscribes. And uh, yeah. See you guys later.